In tonight's Golden Apple, the Bemidji Middle School Robotics team has been busy preparing for the VEX Robotics World Championship that will be taking place in Dallas, Texas this coming May, which is a pretty big deal saying as how BMS is two out of eight teams within the state of Minnesota that get to go. There were four BMS Robotics teams throughout this school year that made it to state, and out of that four, two teams had tied for third, which qualified them for this next competition. Very, very proud of how they've worked this year. Their design process throughout the year is we've gone to competitions and they've tested what they've built and they've looked at other designs and they come back and they're like, well, this worked and this didn't. So they've been really going through the design process and it's fun to see them grow throughout the year. Anderson shared that there are two levels at the World Meet, one for high school and one for middle school. For the middle schoolers alone, there will be about 480 teams invited to compete, including international students. Um, there's a lot in the main states, but there's also um, China, there's New Zealand, there's Germany, there's Great Britain. So there's a lot of international competition that's going to be at this event as well. Teams 1532A and 1532D are both excited and honored to be competing at the world tournament for the first time in many years. It's, it's awesome. I mean, I've been doing this for three years, and this is like the big goal. I mean, the thing everyone wants to get to. Our team, we built a robot that can hold one goal in the front, one goal in the back, and a ring can take. Kind of like D team, we've kind of worked together on our robots and taken inspiration off of each other to get these robots almost perfect, perfected for worlds. I haven't gone to worlds before, and this is a like a huge accomplishment for me, at least. 1532D team member Pittman says that for scoring, the team will get 40 points for elevating a goal on a platform, 20 points for being in your zone, and every ring on a post is worth 3 points on the little goal, and the tallest goal pole is worth 10 points. The robot on the platform, if you're able to drive up, is worth 30 points. You can fit about 10 rings, right? Yeah, about 10, 10, 10 or 11. Yeah, 10 to 11 rings, so about 30 to 33 points by filling up a goal. And then if you put rings in the base, so not on a post, that's worth one point also. Lastly, Coach Anderson added that the school tries to tailor this program to allow kids participation, as well as to make things accessible to them so they can have this experience. It's been a good, great honor to work with these kids and to have them accomplish this feat of actually qualifying for the world competition. Both teams 1523A and 1523D will be heading to the world meet starting May 3rd through the 5th. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.